Hello all you beautiful people, how are you doing here today? This is Lava Temptress for the Gaming Dynasty channel and welcome back to the channel. Or if you're new here, welcome, hi! So today we're going to be playing some more My Time at Sand Rock. I am having so much fun with this game. I knew I would because I really liked My Time at uh, Portia, so yeah. All right, let's see if we can, if our bronze is done so we can complete our commission order today. That'll be nice. May expose valuable items on the surface. Come on. You can do it. It's thinking about it. Well, I would have paused it if I knew it took this long. There we go. All right, let's see. Mm, that'll only keep it on for one day. What about? That's only one day too. Oh well. Um, and let's add to it. Alright, so now we can go turn in our commission. Since he is right up here, we're gonna run right up here and turn it in. Wait, hello. Thanks, builder. You know, I can't remember being so un. un I'm upset at a builder before. Keep up the good work. I don't know why that twist be up. Catch you later. Yay! Alright. Oh. Not a gift. I don't think he would like. Catch you later. Hello. I think the color red makes me mad. Like a wild yak mountain. No wait, maybe it's blue. What's that you're wearing? Urgh. Maybe it doesn't have nothing to do with colors at all. Catch you um. later. Okay. Interesting. Okay, let's head back in here. Um, I think we're gonna skip that today and we're gonna go straight down here. Let's go get some mining done. Yes, let's go down to four. Let's try to find our way all the way down. We're gonna go mining, mining, mining. Alright, so... Up a data disk, okay. Oh, wait, we probably want these power strings. Go. 
Here's some tin. Got a little bit of copper wire over here. I think it's another level. I think every time we go into a black screen, it's another level. Woot woot. Oh, that didn't really give us anything. Okay, and there's some more ten over here. Mm, okay, so this should be the exit. It's a weird looking area. Lots of stuffy stuffs. Oh, why is it not hitting that? There we go. We're on layer five. out of stamina. So, we're gonna go back. Exit the mines. We'll probably um, go to the saloon, maybe get something to eat, and then come back. But that way we can have lots of bronze going. Should probably have one cooking like copper, but we'll see. Oh, you know what I forgot to do? I forgot to bring my horse. Wait, where was my horse? Oh, 
Was my horse there and I just didn't see him? I don't think he was. Oh yeah, he is. Oh yeah, I can't do that. Um, we want to take the artifacts. Oh yeah, we should go turn in some of the artifact stuff. Oh, and we should take some data disc with us. pieces. Okay, so we don't have the rest of those. We need to put those up. These we have all three, so we need to take that. Alright, let's go check out the museum. have a completed relic to go turn in, which is awesome. I'm not gonna have enough time to oh, I didn't even talk to him while we're on the horse hey if you work hard don't forget to play hard too stop into the golden goose sometime it helps take the edge off see ya why does this look like a toy shop Excuse me, ma'am. Might I have a word? I'm new to Sandrock, and I would be remiss to pass up an opportunity to speak with a dignified-looking damsel such as yourself. <laughs> My stars! Did you listen to that? I reckon that must be the phrasings of a bona fide Taran gentleman. Ain't nobody talks fancy like that around here. Well, what can I do you for, newcomer? Looking for good eats? Or just a place to kick up your heels? I've been ranching these parts for more than 20 years. Reckon I ought to know a thing or two by now. Just ask our builder here. Hmm. I believe you. I'm Ernest, by the way. I'm here on the behalf of the Atara Times. I was hoping to do a piece on that bandit fellow who's been giving you all so much trouble. Would you care to weigh in on the situation? Oh. I reckon you mean Logan. Mr. Ernie, sir, I, I don't suppose you were on that train, were you? You still want to catch up with that rascal? Well, here's my way, then. You'd do best by packing your bags. That Logan's a wanted man. And he likely won't take kindly to a fancy talking, pants wearing, city slicking point Dexter snooping around. No offense. <laughs> if you want to write about something, write about the scenery. Try some of our Yakmal sausage. It's so good. People all the way from Porsche make their way over to stock up on it. <laughs> Logan, forget about it. Wait till the core catches him, then ask him yourself. Uh, 
and it was going so well. <sighs> I've really hit a wall these past few days. Can't seem to get anyone to open up. Are they really so afraid of one guy? Is it my cologne? You, Builder. Um, despite all that, I don't suppose you would be willing to answer some of my questions about Logan. Uh, Ask away. Really? You will? Fantastic! One moment, let me just get out my notebook. For this interview, please try to be as objective as possible. Try not to let your feelings or any biases get in the way. It's important that I only get the facts as I try to understand this bandit persona. <laughs> First question. Do you know Logan personally? That's alright. Still, you've lived here for a while, haven't you? I believe your insight may yet be of use. Tell me what he looks like. I mean, have you seen the posters around here? They really couldn't have found a picture of him without a bandana over his face. Just a simple description will do. Uh... Hmm. Tom Walton. So you've never seen his face either. I got a quick look at him. That disarming glare. Ice cold. I'll never forget it. And even through the bandana, you can see there are stories written on his face, just waiting to be told. <laughs> Logan's accomplice. The man who helped him on the train. What do you know about him? What's his name? Um... Haru and Aaron. Logan. I see. Yes, I noticed that they seem to be close. Each one seemed to know what the other was about to do from just a quick glance. Hmm. So, that's all you know? Well, I appreciate your honesty. As a non-native Sandrocker, I suppose I should have expected as much. But, I can tell you did your best. Thank you. Come on, get a quick picture. Meet in earnest. In any case, I suppose this counts as my first complete interview. They sent me here to just do a little throwaway piece for Ernie's world. But this whole bandit thing is gold! My editor Eduardo is gonna flip! Bandits? On your train? It's more likely than you think. Mm, no, that's no good. <laughs> Ne'er do well nabs, Nada? Uh, no, how cheesy is that? Uh, hey there, kiddo. I seem to keep seeing you around. You're not following me, are you? Are you all right? I'm fine. Are you lost? Where's your mother? I'm not lost. I live here. My ma's in the desert now. Ah, I see. In the desert. Oh, goodness. Sweetie, where do you live? Do you need someone to help you get home? No, um, you're Ernest, the writer. Did you write the Maltese Pigeon? <laughs> oh, you're a fan, huh? Gosh, why didn't you say so? Oh, that book you've got, that's my latest release. Why don't I sign it for you? Aww. Oh, that would be great. Thank you, Mr. Ernest. Hey, anything for a fan. Who should I make this out to? Jasmine. That's J-A-S. Uh, huh. And Jasmine, sweetie, why don't you tell me, what was your favorite part about this book? Um, actually, I thought the story this time was a bit contrived. Eh? Contrived? Wow, such a big girl word. Where did you... I'm not finished. The characters are paper thin. And if you've even been paying <laughs> half attention, you can see every twist coming from a league away. I think you've been really writing it in lately. Your old stuff was way better. <laughs> well, little kid, with all due respect, you're a little kid and you don't know anything. Wow. I'm your primary demographic. Actually, as you can clearly see displayed on the back cover, the book is intended for all ages. Well, that's all the time I have for today. Here you go, and cheerio! Wow, look, Mr. Teddy! We got an autograph from Ernest, the famous writer! 
Let's put it under our pillow tonight. You really can't please everyone. She's kind of right, though. My novels have only ever really caught on with the under-12 demographic. It's gotten so hard to continue to outdo myself. Uh... uh you yes. right, folks? The Maltese Pigeon is my most famous work. It's a classical whodunit mystery where it turns out it was the butler all along. <laughs> Oops. Guess I spoiled it for you. <laughs> well, it's still good. I recommend you check it out. Anyway... That little girl sounded a lot like my critics in Walnut Groove. They rated my latest novel a rotten score of three walnuts out of ten. But, pff, I don't write for them. I write from the heart, okay? It okay. was nice running into you again, Builder. But I really should get back to work. Despite the one-off critic here and there, plenty of fans are in fact looking forward to- Oh, hold on. I had to get a different picture. This one looks better. What I come up with in Sandrock. So long. All right, mission complete. A mysterious bandit located the carriage, but to the surprise of those around, left empty-handed. What was his motive? The truth is, ahem. This will be such fantastic material. I'm feeling the passage flow through my fingers already. This town may be a... Oh. Oh, hold on. Hello. I don't know if I'll ever get used to how dry it is here. How do you people deal with this? Very carefully. Okay. Adios. Mucha cha. Carry that around, gross. Let's see what's going on down here. Hey, Owen. I hate that I have to go around and talk to him, but it's fine. Hey, drop by my saloon sometime and listen to my stories. I know all about this town and its history. All right, catch you next time. Is that all you ever talk about? I'm pretty sure that's all he ever talks about. I wonder when story time is, because, you know, apparently I missed it. And we already missed time to go get a uh, commission for today. I'm pretty sure it's not open right now. Oh, maybe I'm wrong. You're still here. Ha <laughs> ha! Wandering around aimlessly, eh? That is so you. Great news. I've got something you can do right here. <clears throat> yes, I was hoping to uh, run into one of you builders. You see, that pesky Logan has struck again. More specifically, he struck this here train window. And, uh, yeah, you know the drill. Guess who needs to fix it? Jensen called me over all in a huff. Where, 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 my poor widow Twain? Normally, I wouldn't entertain, let alone reward such babery. But Matilda was standing right there. So, yeah, better get it done quick. But all of that is neither here nor there since you're here, clearly with nothing better to do. So you'll have no trouble accepting this commission, am I right? The train wow. is stopped now at the station. Just get some glass and fix the window. Should be easy as pie. Well, off you go then. Scoot, come see me when it's done for your pay. All right, so we have that mission and then let's see if we can pick up one of these. Um. Ooh, three bronze plates. Let's do that one. Uh, because we should have some bronze, and so before I head off to bed for the night, then I will start turning some into plates. Mm. 
And then plates. The grinder, maybe? Nope, not the grinder. What about this one? Yeah. I didn't go. Oh well, we'll do it tomorrow. Did I miss anything on the calendar today? Nope. Alright, they should be happy we went to bed early tonight. So I should have stayed up and finished it. I didn't know that. So I'm making that glass for nothing. I'm not there. I need... I can go in her room. Come on, Heidi. There we go. You know I can count on you. You and Mion are the real deal. So long, partner. Hello. I was off studying in Atara for a few years. When I got back to Sandrock, I could hardly recognize the place. So many people had moved on. Wow. See ya. Mm -mm -mm. Yep, I usually use the power stones if I have it for a fuel. the building so um howdy jeez lucy you can't even fix a flipping window for pete's sake all of the uh, and the worst part about it is the pencil push and poindexter jensen has been breathing down my neck this whole time thoroughly souring my days off luckily i was able to shove it off to Mion, so you're off the hook for now but i won't forget the trouble you caused me listen lucy try to think of someone other than yourself for once hear me just look at Mion. She handled that window like a champ. How do you expect to compete with her? Bungling such a layup of a task, huh? I can pretty much tell you right now who won't be placed, placing second on the builder charts this year. Here's a hint. You. Wow. Now, I know you're new, but we at the Commerce Guild have high expectations for you. So snag an extra commission this week for your old buddy, Yon. Okay. So long, partner. Um, let's see. Hmm. Let's do the thin thread. Um. That's not what I want. He said I can snag an extra one, right? Um, let's do... Three days to finish, so... Um, let's see. We do hardwood planks. Do I have hardwood? Uh, three days. Okay. 
So now, so, what did he mean? Hey there! See ya! Hmm. No idea. I didn't realize the glass one had to be done last night. I feel stupid now. That's okay. It happens. Alright. Let's see, I don't even know if I have hardwood. Uh, let's do mechanical scrap. I add another one of these too, because I'm constantly at the end of the craft. Um, and then Let's go turn this in. I wish it would tell me before I was headed out. Okay, so what do I need to turn this in? Oh, thin thread. I only have seven out of twelve. Wait, what? Oh my goodness. Don't know why my house was doing that, but okay. Hello. Okay. There you go. This is just what I was looking for. Thanks, Lucy. Don't be a stranger. Thank you. Hello. Right. I hope you and my granddaughter Heidi can work well together. She's the best architect to come out of Atara in 20 years, you hear? Catch a little. Sure, Granny. Okay, so what am I gonna go do today? Mm. I wonder where is a good place to get wood. Hello, I'm in the process of building a new furnace or two. The current lineup just isn't cutting it. How about you? Hanging in there? Eh, could be better. Do I have anything I can gift her? Um. See ya. No. See ya. I don't want to give her something like that. Yeah, 
some dead wood. Starting to get some really good wood. Think now, Mr. Rooster. There we go. He just likes to get up on things, doesn't he? how to cook stuff because we're getting some meat Hi. out of this. I'm playing polo with my horse here. To grab some more materials faster this way. Like that. Oh, it's up here. Wait, did I get it? Shiny scorpion. John doesn't jump out as having. jump out is having an obvious use but it's sought out by many a salesman huh okay I think the uh, rooster where are you going horsey I think it was a snoring the rooster hey wait a minute wonder if there will be another scorpion under any of this
I like having a horse to ride around. That's for sure. It's copper. Um, wait, up here, right? Yeah. more down here. Quality wood scrap. Okay, out of stamina now. Alright, let's make sure these keep going. Um... I don't think I'll do it anymore. So let's see. Make some copper bars. Hmm, should I make another of something else? I don't know. I mean, I really could get another. Oh, let's do another recycler. Buy right, two mining stalls. Let's put this down. Okay, and we're gonna do let's do mechanical. Do power crystals. And let's add. So that way that keeps going. Alright. Those are all going. Let's uh, deposit what we have. Why did I pull something out? I have no idea. I need to sort these as far as what's in what. I guess we could start organizing a little bit. Let's grab all food stuff. Um, let's see. Uh, used to make medicine, so that's not food. That's food. That's food. Eye drops are considered food, which is weird, but whatever. That's food, that's food. Yellow lavender. Uh, okay, so it's to make medicine. Yep, that one's food. Okay, so the second one here will be all food stuffs. So maybe I should make one of those duplicators. So we'll need marble brick. Okay, marble brick, it's a bit leather. Um, 
marble bird stone chop. Okay, so basic leather and marble bird. Okay, so where do I do marble work? Over here? No, I think it's in here. Um, not stone slate. So where do I do marble work? Need recipe. Okay. So I guess that's all we can do for tonight. Well, we don't have time for a third day, so that's going to be it for today. Um, if you're loving this, let me know. If you haven't already, don't forget to hit that subscribe button with the notification bell so you can see when all the new videos come out. Thanks so much for being here. I appreciate each and every one of you. And until next time, this is Love Attempt Just Stumpy Burned. Bye!